All right, Fight News Australia with Bam Bam, Ty Tuivasa. Ty, yesterday you said you're sick of eating good, sick of drinking good. You must just be chomping at the bit to get back in there, yeah? Pumped, man, pumped. Uh, always the last couple of weeks, you know, you get over the training, you get over being a good boy, get over all that. But uh, that's the fight biz. That's why we do this. That's what we do. And I saw you posted on Instagram that you got a call from David Tua. And, I did. And... That was, you know, you said that that was awesome. Why was that so special for you? David Tua, he's uh, <laughs> it's a normal person, you know, he's still one of the greatest boxers ever. Uh, Tua Samoan is, is a great, an icon, uh, a god. Um, you know, to get a call from, uh, you know, to be a fighter and to get a call from someone we look up to be one of the best fighters of, of all time. It was such a lift for me, uh, and uh, I'm very grateful that I, you know, that I that I got people like him know who I am, uh, and I, it makes me feel like I've worked, uh, I've worked good, and um, what I've done in the past is, is is working. What kind of things did he say to you? Was he giving you like words of encouragement, things to do yeah, in the yeah, fight? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just telling me, you know, I I, I believe in you. I, I know you got all the tools, he goes, but just calm down, just take your time, look for the shot. And he and he's right, and that's what I've learned uh, myself as well. You know, I'm a bit, <laughs> I'm a headhunter. I'm, uh, I'm in there for, I'm in there for blood, and I've got to calm down my, myself and, and, and uh, you know, calm down and take my time. Have you ever met him in person before? I have, I have. And you obviously watch a lot of his fights growing up. He's a killer. What, what was his favourite fight of yours? Him, <clears throat> uh, and bah, fuck. Bucci, Bucci. It's one of the best fights. It's I think, I think it's one of the best heavyweight fights ever. Balbucci or whatever. You know the crazy man. He went crazy. Knocked him out. Nah, they went the they went the twelve. It's not very often David Tua goes twelve rounds. It was the highest, most punches thrown ever in a boxing fight. I'm sure. I think. And the opponent this week, Sergio Spivak. Do you know how to say his name? Spivak. Have do you know much about him? Have you watched many of his fights? No, that's not my job. Uh, I don't really watch uh, any of my opponents. I leave that for my coaches. Uh, they do the coaching. I do the fighting. And Justin Tuffer is on this card. What can we expect from him? Man, Mosul's a bad man. He's a bad, bad man, and uh, he's, he's he's laid a lot of people out and. And I'm hoping he comes out here and, and lays this guy out as well. And he's been bumped up to the pay-per-view with yourself. Like, how amazing is that to have one of the bros with you in front of potentially 60,000 people? It, 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 that's why we do this as a team, man. You do this uh, you do this hoping that your brothers do well. You do this hoping that your team does well. Um, Mark Hunter, you know, has led the way for all of us. He brought us all together. He, he, he made us a team. And... Uh, Look, we're coming, man. We we got we got some of the heaviest hitters in our squad, and, and it's it's about time that the world's going to start seeing it. Do you feel any extra pressure coming into this fight? Not at all. Every fight has pressure. Um, like I've said, uh, you know, many times today, losing's losing, winning's winning. It is what it is. It happens in all in all in all forms of life, and uh, I've won many and I've lost a couple. And they're not to no slouches either, so <laughs> it is what it is. Awesome, thanks, Ty. Cheers, oh, brother. Oh. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Cheers, brother.